So you came into NBC, they were doing lousy, right? Different Strokes and Hello Larry, that was the comedy lineup, okay? That's pretty bad. Really bad. So so you go out and you find, um, well, let's think about it, Seinfeld. Seinfeld. You got Cheers. Cheers. Uh, Cheers, I was the low man on the totem pole, but at the end of the first season, yeah. the lowest rated show in the in all of the network competition, right. at the bottom of the heap is Cheers. Cheers. Right. Yeah. Okay? Cheers. So, yeah. Go but ahead. we renewed it because we liked it. We believed in it. It changed the DNA of NBC. Cheers was a huge hit. The guy they wanted to, the network wanted to hire to play Sam Malone, it says in your book. Fred Dreyer. Was Fred Dreyer, Hunter. Yeah. 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 And, and Fred Dreyer hadn't done Hunter yet. That's the show you gave him instead of Cheers. Mm -hmm. well, and, but you said, I don't want Fred Dreyer because he's too old. No. No, I actually thought Fred Dreyer gave a great audition. Right. Here's the key. We listened to Jimmy Burroughs. And the Charles Brothers. Jim Burroughs is a genius, right? He's a genius. He said Fred Dreyer is not good for the part. He, he knew. He said, I got what I got out of Fred. It was a long, tough process. Now right. we're going to do a series. We're going to do 24 episodes a year. And you better be good. Ted Danson was your pick? Ted Danson was the Charles Brothers and Jimmy Burroughs pick. And no one really and knew Ted Danson. No, no, no he one He was knew. an unknown. Hey, we made stars. Isn't it amazing so, how sometimes, so we you listened, know... So we listened right. to the executive producers. We thought the upside for Fred Dreyer probably was the biggest upside. Wow. Imp impressive. But, but we listened to the people we got in business with. Some people were pushing for William Devane. To be Sam he, Malone. He also uh, auditioned. It was a great audition, but somehow Ted and Shelley made it fresh. It was young, and there there absolutely was a spark. Shelley Long uh, was the original girl in Cheers. Yeah. Did she commit the ultimate career suicide by leaving Cheers? She thought she had a feature career. And she didn't. Did well, you tell her you don't have a feature career? Did you sit her down and try and talk sense to her? You know, I didn't. Um, uh, basically, she had a plan. She was very clear in her plan. She but when you have a star, years. when you have a star like that, and the, the network's making a fortune off of Cheers, don't you make some last ditch attempt to convince her that she's committing career suicide? Um, we did, the Charles brothers, and Jimmy did. Right. And ultimately, she had a plan, and we moved on. It was the greatest thing that ever happened to the show. Kirstie okay. Alley comes in. Yeah. And we went more years with Kirstie Alley. Then we had Shelley Long, and it changed what the show was, and that's was, a good thing. And it changed it, you say, for the better, right? It Absolutely. became bigger. Absolutely. I had nothing against Shelley Long, but you know what? Thank you, Kirstie Alley, because she nailed it.